All right, let's do another quick product review here. This is the uh, HYDIV268N5A. This is a stepper driver. Um, from what I've read on the internet, these tables are wrong, so don't go by these. What's my overall thoughts on this guy? Um, it actually didn't do too bad. It, it, I mean, it really didn't. It may have, it, it does have uh, less power than the bigger guys. It only goes up to uh, 48 volts, and I think that's like the very max uh, top voltage limit for it. Um, and I, you know, the 5 amp right there is the absolute maximum for the chips inside so you're if you're running it at at 5 amps at 48 volts you know you're you're asking for it to die uh, that being said this particular model there this particular drive this exact drive here was being run at 3.3 uh, amps and it was being run at and again the current the current micro switches are right this the step driver uh, micro or uh, a micro step micro switches are wrong and there's some tables online in a couple of different spots uh, to find the correct values for it but uh, the key thing is is that I was running I believe it was 16 uh, 16th or 8th inch step <clears throat> it was hooked up for all of two seconds and the magic smoke just came rolling out of it uh, rolling out of it good I double checked all the connections make sure I didn't do anything wrong that's always a possibility even though I double checked before I ever power anything everything looked right uh, I immediately unplugged it and plugged in that one right there which is exact same model and there was no issues whatsoever so it was not a wiring issue it was straight a drive issue um, now the the seller has not made that right yet I have to send that in um, to them to get a uh, to get my refund now I don't mind that uh, you know obviously they want to make sure that I'm not um, you know just trying to screw with them or whatever and, and that's totally understandable but at the same time yeah you know I have a lot of stuff to do so getting down to the UPS place or whatever and and then obviously I now I have to pay for uh, pay for shipping back um, that's kind of uh, disgruntling um, so anyway um, do I recommend this guy you know, I if you're doing a budget mill, a budget machine, you can pick up three of these drives for the cost of almost. You can almost pick up three of them for the cost of of one of these. You can pick up four of them for the cost of one of these, which is not the same brand. Looks identical, it's identical settings, identical specs. Um, but it's not the same name on it. Four of them for the cost of the end guy. Uh, three of them for the cost of the other ones. So you could literally have six drives for the cost of two drives, which would be roughly a hundred and say hundred and thirty dollars, hundred and thirty, hundred and forty dollars for six of these guys, and have three spares. And they will replace it, and they will fix it if some if one goes wrong. And they were uh, they were having no issue whatsoever driving uh, a 490 ounce inch uh, stepper motor on this guy right here. As a matter of fact, on my video uh, of my first air cut, it was actually one of those guys that was running it at, at those speeds. So and obviously it's not cutting, uh, so it may it may stall out, but it may run a hundred percent, and 
obviously there's very few people that are going to cut on a on a mini mill at 100 inches a minute which was what that um was what that was little show was was doing so so all in all you know take it for what it's worth they might have the might not have the longest <clears throat> life expectancy but for a general purpose all around decent low cost driver yeah it might not be a bad idea to give them a shot uh really might not be a bad idea to give them a shot uh that being said these drives right here even at their cost of right around 60 bucks are a pretty good drive they will run 80 volts 90 volts I believe I'm not a hundred percent certain I'll have to look again um, seven what's the max amp say on there 7.8 amps 5.6 RMS um, so that'll move a pretty good sized motor as a matter of fact nope I have a different drive on there same spec so uh, that's uh, enough to raise and lower that spindle head uh, very quickly uh, very quickly um, running on a yeah, medium pitch ball screw so can't uh, I can't complain a ton can't complain a ton uh, sorry for the shaky video the other camera is getting uh, getting hot the sensor is overheating because well I'm in Florida and it's a bear so I think I'll be doing most of my uh, product reviews I don't need real high definition on the uh, on the iPhone and I will be leaving the how to's and uh, other videos for the uh, Canon thank you subscribe like share comment all the above uh, all at once dislike leave me a reason thank you